Now the next topic is language of the Quran. Everybody knows it's Arabic. Inna jaalnahu Quranun Arabiyan. But which Arabic? There are so many Arabics. Not only today, there were so many Arabics in the day of the Prophet also. There were accents, different accents, different slangs. Today, you know, the, a, a, an Arab from Libya cannot understand a person from that. Even during the lifetime of Muhammad, we find in the hadith that the deputation came from the Najd, the area of Najd. And what they were saying, the, the companions say we couldn't understand. Only the Prophet was understanding what, he, what they were saying. We couldn't understand. The same Arabic language, but the accent was so different that the companions, people living in Madinah, they couldn't understand it. So it was Arabic, no doubt. But there were so many Arabics. And they are, there are so many Arabics. And at the time of Muhammad Sallallahu also, there was no one Arabic. But which Arabic is the language of the Quran? It's the Arabic of Hijaz, to say it generally, but not of Hijaz also. The Arabic, the language of the Bedouins of Hijaz, not the urban Hijazis. Because the Arabs, you know, they thought that because to the cities, people come from outside. Some of them settled there. And especially in Mecca, you know, caravans were coming from Yemen, caravans from Syria, caravans coming and going. So actually, the language of the cities and towns is corrupted. It doesn't remain pure. That is why they used to send their newborns, you know, to the desert, go out to the desert and be raised among the Bedouins so that your language remains pure. So it's actually the language of the Bedouins of Hijaz.